Well, okay, why do you pray to idols? That's, that's, that's what's called a complex question, right? So a complex question is, uh, why do you hate your brother? You know, why, and, and the, the answer or the accusation, uh, the condemnation is implied in the question, you know. Catholics don't pray to idols, right? Catholics pray to representations of uh, heavenly figures. So Catholics pray to Jesus and they use statues to get their mind to think about Christ. Uh, and the reason for this, and, and the same thing with all the saints, of Mary and the saints, the angels, we do this with icons and not just statues, etc. The reason for this is because the human mind learns by interacting with the, with the things around it, right? When I come into interaction with the material things around me, my mind automatically starts to form uh, opinions about these things. My mind begins to form understanding about these things that I'm sensing, the things that I'm touching, the things that I'm seeing, the things that I'm smelling. My mind begins to form an idea of what these things are. And so we really can't understand things without coming into contact with them sensibly. So the, the mind and the body work together in this way. The body interacting with things is kind of transmitted into the mind and the mind begins to understand the, the, the things that the body comes into contact with. Without that, we're really just thinking about ideas detached from the material world around us. And we really, our minds don't work that way. So the reason why we use statues and the reason why we use icons and these kinds of material representations of the things that are in heaven and the people that are in heaven is just to help our minds understand exactly what we're doing and who we're interacting with. It's not that, you know, I, I have a, a two foot statue of Jesus and I think that Jesus is two foot tall. That's ridiculous, right? I don't look at a statue of Mary and say that right there, that resin statue of Mary is the Virgin Mary herself here on earth. No, it's not, there's no Catholic in the world. I hope no Catholic in the world that believes that. But we look at the statue, we look at the icon, we look at a picture so that our mind is elevated from that picture to what it represents, which is in heaven. And so it's just a way, a, a method of helping us understand more so that our mind is more focused on, in, our, in our prayers.